ground. But first, the campaign against racism in football, Kick It Out, have released an app they hope will be another weapon in the fight against abuse at footy matches. The lower leagues kick off this weekend and it's hoped some of the ugly stories that came out of the game last season don't reappear. There have been plenty of high-profile incidents in recent years, but it's hoped this app will help people report abusive behaviour directly from the terraces. The atmosphere in the ground, the cheering and chanting from the crowd are all part of what makes football great. But what do you do if you're at a match and you hear something abusive? Well, according to anti-racism campaign Kick It Out, using your smartphone could be one of the answers. They've released an app that lets users report racist, homophobic or other abuse as and when it happens. Maybe if you don't feel quite comfortable talking to Stuart, this gives you a chance to actually download a very simple app that will let you report right away through to the club. Um, and hopefully action will be taken right away. Put down exactly what you've heard and just submit it. It's literally two or three steps, it's very simple. Kick It Out thinks more needs to be done to stop incidents of racist abuse at games. But they say it's often difficult to pick out who's responsible when big crowds direct chants at players and other supporters. Only last year, Tom Adeyemi from this club, Oldham Athletic, was brought to tears during a match against Liverpool at Anfield because of racist abuse from the terraces. They manage to arrest the person responsible, but often abuse goes unpunished. Kick it out to celebrating 20 years of campaigning against inequality in football, but some people think they could have done more to tackle racism. We can't arrest anybody and we can't investigate, but we can challenge the authorities and push the authorities, football and the FA to try and change things, and I think we'll continue to do that. The campaign hope that now this app is available, it'll be a step in the right direction, but it's up to fans at football matches to download it and start using it for it to make a real difference in stamping out racism in football. OK, staying with sport and a win or a draw for England